Hi everyone, Cheryl here with another Cottage Cuts video for you and this one is on the new um, lace envelope and this is in the Tea Time collection. I love this collection and I love this envelope. And so I'm going to show you how to do the score lines on it today. And so what you're going to want to do is go ahead and your die already comes um, pre-foamed and so you'll just want to go and it's already prepped for you so you'll just want to face it up on your machine and oops okay and so face that up and then I just cut a six a six inch wide piece of cardstock and I don't even know how long it's eight and a half long it, do, it doesn't have to be that long I just went ahead and cut um, a piece from an eight and a half by eleven. Okay, so run that through the back shots. This little envelope is so sweet. And so now what I'm going to do is I just use my um, fingernail and I kind of go ahead and get some of the pieces to come out. I, I find that is faster um, than sitting there poking each piece. Sometimes I'll go ahead and do it that way. And then now, I'll put, there's a couple pieces that I need to get. Pretty easy. Okay. So that, that's done. And what I'm going to be using is the score pal to go ahead and score this. And so let me go ahead and see. I'm hoping you're going to be able to see this. Whoops. Sorry. Okay. And I hope I'm in close enough. So what I do is the corner of your envelope, I match that up to the top of the score line. So the corner and then on both sides and then just go ahead and take your bone folder or your scoring tool and give that a score. And actually I should have flipped it this way. So the the top of this should be the outside. Sorry. And where's my line? There it is. Hopefully this is in the video. Okay. So there's that one. It's pretty easy to do with um, the Scorpel. So I've got those two done and now same thing on this. I just matched this corner, the top part, to the top part of the line. And then go ahead and run your folder through. Or your, the little tool. I forget what it's called. And get that to the top. Okay. And hopefully you can still see that. Whoops. I'm not in range. Yeah, I am right there. Okay. So now what I'm going to do is just fold on that crease line and take the, I guess, the bone folder and just lightly give that a good um, score. And same with that one. And this is perfect for a gift card. Um... You can put your business cards, a little invitation to tea would be cute. Okay, so now that I have all the score scoring done, I'm going to bring it up just a tad. The next thing you'll want to do is this little flap here is the top, so I'm going to bring this one in. I'm going to use score tape to go ahead and tape um, the sides. And so I just go ahead and take a little piece. And hopefully you can see that. And I'm just following. And it's probably going to need. Okay. And then do the other side. This envelope is so darling. I love it. Okay. And 
Close that up. Perfect. And there you have a little a little envelope. Oh, you could always go ahead and give that a nice score again. And to close this, once you put something in it, I think what I would do is just put a little piece of score tape. And you don't even have to remove until you're ready to give it. So you just put your score tape there and then it'll hold it down. And I hope you enjoyed. And here's the front where you can add your writing or stamping or whatever you'd like. And so I hope you enjoyed today's video on the Cottage Cut Lace Envelope. And thanks for stopping by and we'll see you next time. Have a nice day.